Greetings everyone, this is Spin Dash here, and today I'm on Snowbrain Containment Zone. This game just got released about a week ago, and I'll be pulling for the game's first limited 5 star character, Acacia Kagua. Without further ado, let's begin our pulls. So, a little background information before I start actually pulling on the banner itself. I have currently, where I'm standing at, on savings wise, I have 13,330 Digicash, which is the premium currency of Snowbreak. And basically, how you get that is basically doing your, well, your basic stuff, task, complete story, and events. And all of this is free to play. I did all this solely by doing my daily, weekly tasks, targets, which is the achievements of the game, main story, and of course the events. And this game is rewarded you greatly, especially early on if you're a new player. Most gacha games do, but this one seems to be pretty heavy about it, especially if you install the game on day one, since you got a bunch of compensation rewards that were given to you, which came in the form of the, the echoes and the many forms of digicash if I can get it out correctly. And of course, I, this is all free to play earnings by the way, and to prove that, I'm going to show you something right here. So if you top up for the first time on Snowbreak, you get this, you get Fanny's outfit, Delusional Starlet. I have not topped up yet, so I don't have the outfit. So this video, this pull session, I would say, is going to be a true free-to-play experience. So without further ado, we're going to be pulling for the first limited five-star character, Acacia Kagua. Will we, I already have seven of the Manifestation Echo Covenant which is the wishes of Snowbreak. So, where will this take me? We do not know. I do not know. Will I, will I get her early? Will I lose to 50-50? Will I be able to get the weapon? Probably not, but anyway, let's just go ahead and get going. All right, without further ado, we will start with the first 10 pool. Here we go. And we swipe down to get this done too. Alright, two four stars. <clears throat> Alright. Well, I already got free shield. Alright, so I got the four star Keisha and another free shield. Yeah, I did some pulls beforehand. So, and that's just not that much. Like, mostly on standard bear, but that was free to play pulls that I got. But anyways, let's continue. Swipe down. Alright, another 4 star. Nothing too significant. Nita. Hmm. <clears throat> Don't have too high expectations yet. We still got a ways to go. Another 4 star. Nita again. It's good I do this anyway, because I probably need some four star units to build anyway. Alright, about to hit 40, halfway there. Mm hmm. And yeah. Alright. Okay, we may just have to hit the guarantee here. Free shot again. I probably won't even get... Mm. Let's check the shop real quick. Can I, I purchase some? Well, I can. Not a lot, but I'll take it. If it means discount as free as possible, might as well. Three four stars, one ten pool. All right, I actually surprised me for once. I'm gonna see what I've got. Marion. <laughs> And the last one. Oh, 
you again. Well, just about getting close to completing the four star collection here, so. Alright, one. Wait, I got. Oh, I thought I was about to hit. Alright, 20 more pulls. Oh, we got the five star. Is it Kagua? Come on. moment now. This don't want to get too excited yet. And I got her! Alright! Very nice. And we didn't even... We got her early too. Nice. Nice. We got her early. Alright. I, I only got a two more for put ten pulls here for the weapon there, but I'll give it a shot. I know this is going to be like a shorter beer compared to my Yulon video, but this is mainly just a test. So I got to go big time on this one, but... Let's see where we go from here. Okay. That's just a four star. I needed it anyway. Okay, last ten pull, and this will be it right here. And that's it. Oh, well, that was a buggy mess right there. Okay, so far. I didn't get the five star weapon, and not that it mattered anyway, but still. <laughs> the fact of the matter is, I smashed to get the five star character, and even if you. You don't even need a five star weapon. <clears throat> Hold up, where is she? I know I got her somewhere. There. <laughs> oh my gosh. Why, why am I having such a hard time finding the character I just got? There you are. Yeah, let me just go ahead and get you leveled up. Oh, yeah. And it, like I was saying before, you don't even need her signature weapon. You just even need a, like a four-star weapon is good enough. And sure, I, I still need to do some more research on how to build teams here, but considering that I got her before the pity, it's pretty amazing if you ask me. And well, that pretty much ends my savings. Right there. But anyways, I could still make some good teams out of this, even without the 5 star weapon. And logistics? It wouldn't be a problem too, because you can just grind it out either, so... Grind it out with no hassle. All it just does is just a cost of stamina, do this, and get the logistics officers you want and you'll be set. Same goes for... Now weapons would be a different story, but I guess... I think it was a pretty good, overall it was a pretty good pull session starting out. I mean this is definitely shorter, not as elaborate as my Yulon video from previously, but starting off as a free to play, it's very doable that you can get a 5 star character. Don't get me wrong, 4 stars will carry you through it, you just need to know how to build them and you'll do just fine, but 5 stars are just nice to have. But anyways, as, as I know this is a very short video, but I. Without further ado, I would like to say th thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.